Hey y'all. So I'm at my six week appointment. I'm late. Cause I was supposed to be here two weeks ago. But um yeah, we're about to go. I'm about to go inside. Not we. I'm about to go inside and wait for the doctor to call me. So I'll let y'all know what happens when I get inside. And I am all done, guys. Um, my doctor did a pelvic exam. Gave me some sample buff control pills. Ooh, let me get my stuff. And some KY jelly. You know. Some samples of that, too. I probably dropped one. She ain't doing that. Anyway, yeah. And she said everything looked good. But when they did the vaginal exam, she said that it looked like I had a little bit of discharge. So she just swabbed it. She said it probably was normal. But she swabbed it anyway. And they're going to check my urine because I gave a urine sample. But, um, I'll see y'all later because this is not the whole day. This is just part of the day. Y'all ever use these? So, so I don't know. She said they're supposed to be new progesterone only pills. So, we gonna see how they do. In the two packs though. Until I get the um, next one out because it's on back order. There's some ultra ultra KY jelly slide. I don't know, y'all ever use that? It's water based too. So <laughs> we're gonna see how that work out too. Alright, I guys well I just took these one of these um new progesterone pills um birth control um I really don't I did feel a little nauseous um but I really didn't feel nothing I'll keep y'all updated on it um but I really didn't feel no different my doctor said she didn't want to give me anything with estrogen um, because of the history of high blood pressure I had with my um, pregnancy. But, <clears throat> yeah, I'm breastfeeding. I'm waiting for my lunch. Y'all can hear some nasal because... Apparently, I have allergies, so a real um, I'm real nasally, but yeah. So <clears throat> my paperwork. Can't show y'all my paperwork. Blood pressure was good today. Um, and by the way, it's optional if you want a vaginal exam. Um, a lot of doctors, if you feel like you 
don't want I mean it's before your I think after your six weeks before for your seven weeks you could still be optional on a vaginal um, exam because so anything five weeks five to six weeks they're going to want to do a vaginal exam simply because you know you just had the baby so they want to make sure that it's healed up by by then but anything after six weeks is optional because I mean unless you're having some serious symptoms um then they probably will do an exam just to be safe. Um, but other than that, it's completely optional after six weeks. And um, like I said, that's only for you if you choose to get it. I mean, it's not really necessary, but I chose to get it. And I found out, you know, there could be something going on. You know, so it's always good to just check. Well, my doctor doesn't seem concerned with it because um, she was like, you know, you could still, you know, um, be intimate if you want to or whatever. I just want to check it and be sure. And I told her I had, um, I was going through some, um, some urgency after um, urinating. I think they call it, um, yeah, they call it urgency. Feeling like I have to use the bathroom again after I already emptied my bladder. So she's definitely going to check that out anyway. And I didn't want to do a lot of talking. If y'all see me talking a little bit more, it's because my husband got out to go get my lunch. Um, but yeah, um, I didn't record in there because they had a sign saying no recording, so um, I couldn't really record. On top of that, after I took off my clothes, the doctor came like literally two seconds later, and then after we was done with the um exam, um. She came back. The nurse came back in two seconds. So it was like, there was no time to report what was going on in there. But like I said, I just took one of them pills. So in case you ladies are like, you know, wondering about the progesterone mini pill, I think they're calling it. Um, that brand, I don't know about any other brand, but that brand right there. I didn't have, I don't feel any type of way. Um, with the next one on, I can tell you from experience, because they normally do it right then and there, whatever birth control you try to um, receive. They normally, you know, whether you get IUD, um, you get the pills, they give you those, the pills to get you started, and then they'll sit in refill prescriptions um that's why she having me sample them just in case I'll be like oh I don't you know I don't want to do the next one they have you um sample it first what you got Yeah, guys, I got me a smoothie and a, um, yeah, I had to go out with mom. He don't like the chocolate. Um, yeah, I got me a smoothie and I got me a, um, Strawberry panini, strawberry chicken, strawberry balsamic chicken panini with a bag of chips. And I got them from um, this place called Tropical Cafe. So, 
don't know if y'all have one near you. And I got me a um a sunset smoothie from Tropical Cafe. Not sponsored. It's the one. Try to eat a little healthy because I do feed a little person. Um, so yeah, but that's pretty much how the appointment went. I mean, um, if you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see y'all in the next one.